these people would be whenever their next birthday. So now we're in Peyton. How so old people are? How many days old? So Peyton, we're going to do when he turns eight. So we do 365 days, which is a year, times your, the age, which will be eight. Then you hit plus. And now you count down whatever this year is. Or last time you had leap year. So 16. Do you 16? You got 15, 14, 13. Which is one. 14. Wait, where am I? 15, 14, 13. Then 10, 11, 12. Or 13, 12, 11. And then 10, 9, 8. So he only had. Two leap years. No, three leap years. So you add three. Plus. So Peyton would be 2,923 days old. Wow. How old is mom? I think. Weren't you somewhere in the 11,000s? I think like 11,360 or something like that. 11,000 days. So. That's just crazy. Welcome back. It is third Wednesday, isn't it? It's Wednesday. It's Wednesday. Welcome back. We're you guys. We just got back from piano, ate lunch here, and now Patrick has a map study he needs to do. But we're kind of figuring out ages, how old we are. But not just by ages, not by years. Old. So Patrick says, we. I have a birthday coming up here next week. And Patrick tells me that I am going to be, I am almost 385 months old. And eight more days for my mommy's birthday. Yep. Eight more days to my birthday. Oh, I have counter. I did. Olivia, what are you getting for my birthday? I don't know. Do you know what I want? I want a couple things. Not just a kiss. Hey guys, this boy right here, guess how old he, he how many months he'll be. How how many months are you? He's going to be 36. He's going to be 36 months. Pat, Peyton has a birthday this month too, and he's going to be 96 months old. He's almost 96 months old. This little girl... She's soon gonna be six, or she's sixty-nine months old. Yay! I'm hey, she's just sixty-nine months old. Almost. We were just talking about how funny it would be if we would just somebody asked the ages of my children if I would tell them all how many months they are. Hmm. And as we're just figuring out. This is how, okay, the numbers are backwards. Okay, enough now. I oh, would be 128 months old. So today I get to do something that I have not had the chance to do yet. I'm taking the kids on a field trip. To the planetarium. To the planetarium at the Shippensburg College. Nope, mommy's not coming. It's just me and the three kids. We're going into the planetarium to learn about the universe. Yay! And then, then we're gonna bump them on the head and they'll see stars and they'll be cool. <laughs> Colors of hydrogen or of helium. I see a yellow, red, red, a green aqua, uh, an aqua, and a blue, blue. And then a repeat, maybe. Yeah, do you see them? So if we see those colors, we in the star, we are seeing, we see, we're seeing um, uh, helium. I'll put them both on top of each other, and you can see how the colors are different. Notice the red line of the, the red line of hydrogen is different from the red line of helium. Each of the color, each of the reds, each of those, the position of those lines is associated, is related to the, the, the intensity of the color. Each element has a slightly different uh, a signature of a signature of colors. We know it as uh, we can tell the we know the elements present. Rainbows, pretty. Okay, we're going to. Um, so, uh, who are my volunteers? This sphere turning. Yeah. It looks like the. That's, think of that as the Earth, and we're looking up in the sky, and we're looking at, at the Earth. Yes. Question. I don't. I don't. The Christmas. Okay. Uh, everybody knows that. 
Christmas program. Jack retired, said the Christmas program was here. <sighs> right, yeah, we just got out of there. There's seen some videos, a uh, little bit of it. Of course, I couldn't video any during the presentation. It was dark, and they did not want any light at all. So, um, But then we got to see the machine. What would you think, Peyton? It was uh, awesome. <laughs> That's how I you explain to everything. Up, yeah. yeah, it was cool. When it, was it was cool. So, but it, 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 um... We had the stars go around and all of the stuff it shed some of the patterns on the stars and And we time traveled for a little bit, right? We went behind back in time, then forward in time, then back in time, then back yep, to again at the end. Yeah, and the end he went he went gave us he didn't want us to get leave out of time. He gave all of our time back before we left again, so mm -hmm. That's good. Yeah, that was awesome. It's been years and years. It was back whenever I was probably in Patrick's grade when I was in there last. Um, so that was pretty neat. You know, projector and the equipment they use, he said it was close to 40 or 50 years old. It's old stuff, but it works great. Yeah, a lot of fun. Hello. Hello. Driving down the road and I'm taking care of my coupons. We are heading into Lancaster County again tonight. Got the family all with us. Bunch of them sleeping. But we're heading in here tonight <clears throat> to babysit Carla's sister's children so that they can go out for the evening. Um, they had a little one there a couple months ago. Maybe not quite two months ago. I'm not sure how long it's been. I guess, yeah, it's probably about two months ago. And spent a month or so in the hospital with her. And just, you know, a lot of things, how that goes. So, we decided we're going to come in tonight and uh, watch the children for them. And let them to just go out and spend an evening together. Go out for a meal and whatever. So that's what we're up to tonight. Heading in through. Yeah. It actually has been a couple weeks since we've been in this trail, right? Seemed like for a long time it was once or twice a week we were heading up this road coming into Lancaster County, but it seems like it's been a few weeks. Not really sure. Don't remember. Last time I thought that Carter reminded me it was only like two days. You know, this morning Preston woke up and he said to me, Me big boy, me go potty, and, uh, me go bathroom and potty. Me be a big boy today. And that lasted maybe an hour and a half after third pair of underwear he's like nah me wear diapers <laughs> so but he's getting there he's he's uh determined and we're not gonna push him maybe we should but i know everyone has different ways of doing things but we're just gonna let him take his time and when he's good and ready he will let us you know i think all of our children pretty much went that way didn't they yeah. and then all soon it's just like click they got it so um, that's just kind of how we do it as you can see a couple months ago we had a video that said that and then a couple weeks ago carla updated a little bit on it and that's just kind of where we are he, he comes to us and he's getting to the point where it won't be too long yet because he does not like dirty diapers and as soon as he has a dirty diaper he's coming asking that we change so that's uh let's get to the point where it won't be long and he'll be he'll be uh, body trained Thanks for watching another video. Hit that thumbs up like, oh uh, yeah. Hit that thumbs up button. Hit that like button. That is the same thing, I guess. Hit the subscribe button to join the family. See what we're up to each and every week. We upload every Monday, Wednesday, Friday night at 7 p.m. Have yourselves a wonderful weekend and be blessed. Mm -hmm.